making winter melon soup, one of the classics in Chinese cuisine. Traditionally, this soup is made with bone broth and meat stock, which I won't use here as bone broth and meat contain high fat and are highly inflammatory. The ingredients I use are winter melon, half a corn and cob, dried black dates, red dates or jujube, dried figs, dried honey dates, dried long an fruit, dried shiitake mushroom that's been soaked to soften, and dried scallops that have been well rinsed and soaked. The dried scallops are optional if you want to keep the soup fully plant-based. Start by cleaning the winter melon. Because we'll be cooking it with the skin on, I'll gently brush the skin with a kitchen brush under running water. Then we'll rinse all the dried fruits thoroughly. Next, we'll start to make our stock for the soup base. Add water to the pot. Also add the water from soaking shiitake mushroom and the scallops. Then add the soaked scallops. Dried fruits. Corn. These are the main ingredients that will give our soup its flavor. Bring the pot to boil and let it simmer for a while. Meanwhile, we'll prepare the winter melon. Start by cutting the rind into half. Then remove the spongy part in the middle with the seeds. And cut it to smaller pieces like this. Then, thinly slice the shiitake mushroom. Now, we'll check how our stock is doing. It's important to let it simmer long enough to get the full flavor. Once the dried fruits are looking plump and no longer dried, we can add the other ingredients. Add the mushroom slices and the winter melon pieces. Season with a little bit of salt and brown sugar to really round out the flavor. I like to add seasoning at this point so that the melons get to absorb the flavor as they cook. Cover the lid and continue to cook until the melons are done but not mushy. Now the soup is almost done. Give it a quick mix. Adjust the taste and add a little bit more seasoning if needed. This warming and nourishing soup is ready to be served.